we just ate hella food. But um, free workout should kick in soon. We're here at Zoo Culture. We're focusing on strength, right? Yeah, strength. So start with some deadlifts. Yeah. And then uh, as since we already like took a lot of toll on the lower body today, as the workout progresses, we'll move to more explosive um, stuff for the upper body. Um, now, yeah, because we already did the running and stuff, so our legs are probably fatigued out from that. But we'll get some deadlifts. We'll definitely um, that'll be our main compound strength work, and then we'll have everything else along with that. Yeah, I want to do some core too. Some core? I, yeah, because I know guys don't like doing core, so I, I just have to throw it in there. I don't. My deadlifts, my core cool workout, <laughs> and the ab wheel. I do ab wheel. I see. I preach the ab wheel like all the time, and that's like the only thing I do. I hate the ab wheel. Yeah, all right. You know, all right. So, so start with deadlifts now. Start with deadlifts, and uh, you gonna lift some mad weight or not? Nah. Nah. We'll see. I think um, because we did so much speed and agility work, that really does. It's very taxing on your legs. So I'm gonna see how my legs feel, but probably we'll go lighter and uh, do more negatives, like going slower on the way down. Uh, but it's really more about my muscle connection for me right now. So as long as I'm feeling it, my legs look good, right? Maybe. Okay, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. Hey, 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 hey. 
785. I'm like, what the fuck though? Where the love go? Five, four, three, two, I got one go. Shout out to Venom, yeah. Eminem. Oh, fuck. So 765, and we got 785. So 15 pounds away from 800. I'm fat, I'm fat. I'm fat but my am strong as shit. Good ass job yeah. today. So deadlifts, chest, back. back. Uh, you gotta be crazy to hit all three in one day. Usually, so when, you, when I do something like this, um, so this will be a two a day that I'll do, and uh, the day after I do take rest days, so I'll probably take like a, a rest day for tomorrow, yeah. and then it'll be the same thing for the next day over. So it's either uh, the two a days, and I have a rest day in between each day, or I'll do the, the split where you have like upper body, lower body, yeah. or push pull. Um, type days and then Wednesdays would always be my conditioning day and then uh, maybe a rest day after maybe just go back to a push pool day yeah and uh, so just it depends on how I feel yeah day. so there's like a strategy behind it you can't do this every day obviously you'll burn out um, but like we kind of worked it well this morning we did lower body speed and then when we got in here started deadlifts and from there worked posterior went to back and chest so you know we're training smart still um, yeah I feel like I try with everything it's not an easy thing to do, two a days. Not majority of the average the average person can't do uh, two a days, but um, like I said, you can still do a split. Um, and I mean, this it's easier for us because our life is majority fitness. Yep. So yep. you know what I'm saying. Don't don't feel like pressured or upset that if you can't do it, but if you can, uh, definitely try it out. If you can't, just split it up into two days or something. You know, have a conditioning day and then have like a strength full body day. Uh, that works as well. So. Well, it's been a pleasure training with this beast. Um, I definitely learned a lot. I'm taking a lot from it. And then it's always just fun to connect with elite athletes who, you know, are just so passionate about it because we just drive, we feed off of each other's energy. So I had a great time. I hope you guys enjoyed um, watching, coming along. My name is Jeff. 